Every architect dreams of finding something that will change the history of our past. Although it sounds impossible, it has happened on multiple occasions. Finds that emerge from the bowels of the earth are quickly transformed into theories and discoveries that impact science, history, and countless other areas. However, there are things that archaeologists would rather not have found. If you're interested in discovering them, you'd better stay with us this time and join us as we explore the following stories of archaeologists who wish they hadn't stumbled upon their own finds. Number 5. Mount Owen Moe One of the strangest discoveries in modern history occurred in New Zealand on a 1986 expedition to the caverns of Mount Owen. The intention of the researchers was to explore the network of subway caves of the mountain and try to locate some unusual phenomena. In theory, the idea was interesting, but when they entered the caves, with no other weapons than flashlights and lanterns, things began to get complicated. The darkness was so absolute that the lights could only illuminate a tiny fraction of the enormous caves. Nevertheless, the expedition continued in the gloom until one of the team members stumbled upon a strange object. When the lights fell on it, everyone was horrified, for it was a pile of bones with fresh blood on them. Had someone been recently killed in that cave? What did the blood belong to? What was the explanation for this scene? After taking the bones to the laboratory, it was discovered that the remains belonged to a flightless bird that became extinct 3,000 years ago. One of its claws was among the bones, which had similarities to the legs of Velociraptor. The name of this creature was the Moa, and the claw found had already fallen into the hands of archaeologists, but almost a century earlier, in 1863. Back then, James Campbell had discovered an identical claw, although it was sold to the director of the Dominion Museum to Wellington by a great-great-grandson of Campbell for the ridiculous price of five pounds. According to researchers, this great-great-grandson needed to get rid of the claw because it had been haunting his family for generations. Number 4. An Ancient Chemical War 1933 was one of the most complex years for archaeologist Robert Dumesnil to Boisson, not because of a personal matter, but because of one of the most unusual and frightening discoveries in history. It happened during an excavation in the area of Dura Europas, one of the ancient Roman strongholds used to protect themselves from the sieges of the Persian Empire. The ruins of this site have been extensively explored, but Robert discovered a strange subway passageway that led to a slope located several kilometers below ground. That conduit is believed to have been made in antiquity as a siege route for the Roman stronghold. According to reports, it was possible to enter the interior of the walls and start a massacre without anyone noticing. However, the Romans were prepared, and when they heard the noise of the excavations, they activated one of the most unexpected weapons of the time. The archaeological find yielded the remains of 19 Persians and one Roman person. All of them were found in strange positions, as if they were tearing their skin off and fleeing the scene. Curiously, the walls of the tunnel showed traces of sulfur and bitumen, substances that, when combined, could have formed one of the first chemical weapons in the history of mankind. No solid conclusions have been reached so far, but the finding is really disturbing. Was it the first time that the Romans used this type of weapon? Was it an accident? Was it actually a chemical weapon? These questions continue to haunt historians, but the response of the corpses that met their deaths in these strange circumstances seems to confirm the suspicions. Number 3. Toxic Beer What happens when a country decides to ban something? The immediate answer is smuggling and illegal operations. That's something that the United States and England knew very well during the 19th century when they activated the great prohibition of alcohol and encouraged numerous citizens to start brewing their own beverages outside the law. This had direct consequences at the time, but one of them has taken several decades to appear in the news. It's an unusual discovery made by a team of archaeologists who unearthed nearly 600 bottles of beer from a hidden cellar. 
At first, the drinks appeared to be just liquor made in a hasty and unlawful manner. They turned out to be something worse, much worse. Upon further analysis, the beer bottles were loaded with high concentrations of lead. Each one has enough to kill an adult and, if someone had wanted to, they would have been a lethal weapon to kill hundreds of people with certainty. However, there's no great conspiracy behind this finding, but rather a normal circumstance of the time. During those Victorian times, the pipes were replaced by new ones made of lead. So, the water that was used for making beer ended up having a high lead content without anyone knowing it. Fortunately, this batch of beer never reached consumers, although it isn't known if other batches sold at the time contained the same toxic substance and caused the death of countless lives. Number 2. An Incredible Find Archaeologists are accustomed to encountering all kinds of horrors while excavating. But they rarely are as terrifying as the one that occurred to a foreign team near ancient ruins in China. According to the testimony of these men, one day they found a strange statue of a Buddha. The size was nothing grandiose, but it was above average. The find seemed unrevealing because there are numerous cultures that worship the Buddha figure and use these statuettes for rituals. However, when the team took the millinery statue to the laboratory, they decided to analyze its interior with x-rays to try to find clues that would help them measure its age. It was then that the unimaginable happened. The x-rays showed that the inside of the statue was hollow and had been made to store the mummified bones of a man. This was extraordinary and unusual. How was this possible? After several investigations, it was discovered that the man was an ancient monk who had undergone the horrible ritual of mummification while alive in order to obtain a great reward, which was none other than to be buried inside the Buddha and thus be venerated by future generations. Unfortunately for this monk, his dream was not fulfilled since he had been buried for decades without anyone being able to get close to him. Number 1. The 100 Year Grave War is full of horrors, and World War I is just one example of how creative humans can be when it comes to destroying ourselves. However, a century after these events, ruins and unsolved mysteries continue to emerge. Such is the case of a recent discovery made by a group of French archaeologists who found a trench buried by the earth in 1917 in the town of Reims, France. The excavation lasted several weeks and the result was horrifying. The corpses of 270 German soldiers were discovered in the tunnel. They met a terrible death at the hands of the weight of gravity itself. According to the investigations, the regiment that was in the shaft of this trench was buried after a landslide poured the weight of several kilos of earth on them. In addition to the corpses, all kinds of weapons were found at the scene, such as shells, grenades, axes, rifles, and countless additional objects that include family photographs, clothes, and some jewelry. It's believed that this tunnel was sealed for more than a hundred years and that the death of these men wasn't quick, but slow and desperate. No one knows how much suffering these men endured in their final hours, but one thing is certain, no one would wish to share their fate. Zone Zero You may not know it, but Nevada is home to one of the most interesting fossil dumps on Earth. It's a kind of pit made up, for the most part, of ichthyosaur fossils belonging to at least nine different specimens. Its discovery was a real surprise since it's 228 million years old. However, no one knows how to explain this strange cemetery of creatures. No one but Mark McMenamin who was an extremely interesting theory that has been gaining much more recognition after archaeologists discovered the remains of a strange creature. According to Mark, this fossil dump could be the lair of an ancient giant kraken, a mythical creature with countless tentacles and a size of 30 meters long that, according to ancient accounts, fed on ichthyosaur-like creatures. This theory points out that this mysterious kraken could be the creature responsible for having been filling up this Nevada cemetery because the age of the fossils, as well as their condition, 
give signs that it was a progressive work methodically carried out by a no known being. So far, this mysterious fossil dump in Nevada remains one of the most unusual mysteries on the planet. The answer, of course, remains elusive, but one thing is for sure, there will come a day when a team of archaeologists will find the answer. Will they regret finding it? This is a question that cannot be answered yet. However, there are other mysteries that perhaps can. If you are interested in knowing all the secrets that are hidden under the earth and all the mysteries that archaeological excavations can clarify, you'd better check out the following videos and discover for yourself everything that the past of our planet hides. Are you ready? Here are the videos.